Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're back at ACI Boats here in Fort Townsend, Washington, where they build everything from these 32-foot Bristol Bay gill netters to these all-welded aluminum catamarans from 34 feet all the way up to 60 feet. It's going down right here. We're actually going to drop into the engineering department today, check in with Andre and James, where they always have a whole bunch of fun stuff going on. Hey, Andre, how's it going? You're taking the time, buddy. Absolutely. You guys always have some pretty cool projects yeah. spinning around on your computers. Well, you know, one of the things that we can do here is kind of rapidly work through some concepts by doing some hand drawings. We were able to start modeling this up, which I have here, so that this can go to the next phase in the production process. All right, Andre, thanks, buddy. Absolutely. All right, Thank we're going to go hit James up over here. He was shaking. How you doing, hey, buddy? Hey, Rob. How's it going? Good. Yeah. What are you working on, man? Uh, continuing on our process of developing these boats at a 3D level. You guys have kind of come at a time. You've been out in the shop. You've seen that we've got a lot of the metal work in place. So now we're kind of starting to work out the interiors and some ergonomics. So as I kind of can show you a clipping plane through my boat, you can see where I'm starting to work out Jeez. the bench and the layout using our ergo man to make sure everything as we're developing it, it's gonna be a good flow and comfortable for the clients and the owner of the boat as he's operating. Kind of what we were working up here just recently, the client has specifically requested for railings. some additional railings along this because if they need to get up there to access for cleaning or anything, mm -hmm. so a similar thing with our ergoman, like we're gonna take it through these steps, you know, to really get everything properly located and make sure that it's safe. And you can push but, everything around on here. You've got the windows yeah. in there. What are these, vents on the these windows? These are gonna be vents in the windows. Yeah, so we're yeah. modeling and designing that to a level um, where we can share that information with our vendors mm -hmm. and kind of ensure, you know, that we're gonna get you know, very accurate fitment and allocation of all that stuff. And every single really facet of that boat is right here. All the information we use yeah. to build this to, to even to the rails, you know, the level of mm -hmm. detail that we're putting into the rails. We're going to run spectra line on this uh, particular vessel. And the spectra, of course, doesn't like to take a, a turn. So we're going to mm -hmm. do some piping and run that a single piece of spectra like all the way through you know, from its original termination, you know, starting point here, mm -hmm. all the way and snake it all the way back through to an aft termination. Some advancements or improvements to our hatch um, lids, you know. You to can really, look right down into the stringers you can, from here. Oh, yeah, you can get right down into the full structure of the mm -hmm. boat. And you can see up here, we've developed some platforming. That's for mm -hmm. them to store all of the luggage and stuff for the clients when they're mm -hmm. on the boat. And then they'd be accessing again here inside the boat you know there's a we call that forward bilge access mm -hmm. and we've got a door and kind of same thing you can get right down so you know throughout the whole build again Jeez. we can work out all of these details for fabrication it's very clear and concise communications with the client mm -hmm. you know to make sure that we're capturing their wants and needs and also you know trying to be efficient in you know, our use and development well, it really streamlines the workflow you can finalize everything right here before it goes to the cnc machine and yeah off to the welding floor. Yeah, the more vetting and, and kind of approval and review process that we do yeah. here just really helps everything kind of flow down line. Thank you so much for the All time, right, buddy. Thanks for the visit. Yeah. Look forward always to love stopping into engineering here. There's always so much interesting stuff going on, you know. Yeah, for so sure. appreciate it, man. Right. That's been Live the Boat this week. Don't forget to drop your comments and questions down below. We'll catch you next time.